Hello, I'm Noah Voice Gibby and, and welcome back to Shit My Face Against the Brick Head Wall. What? That made no sense. Well, you just got a little spoiler of what's gonna come up after we've beat Gypsy Moth. Ooh, he's being beamed down. Even though this isn't actually his map, really, it's Alpha Dracon's, I believe. So, you think you can outrace a veteran pilot like me? I'd like to see you try it. Because you know they had to have a token female racer. Although well, it's weird because her eyes don't seem to be blue. And it seems to be like she looks like she's wearing a mask almost then. A full face mask. It's always a really impressively quick loading time. Even on a terrible computer. Back in the 90s and early noughties. I think it was the early noughties when I was playing. There's a lot of greens on this. No near me, or at least it didn't have its tractor beam out when it was near me. Didn't look like it did anyway. That was worth the time. See, no, if I was to send those, it's flying. It wouldn't have lasted that long. Oh well. First place in this one. I have to see how I go in this one now. Boosty thingy. Or oh, where does the lightning come from? Where does the orange, weird Egyptian. It's not orange, but you know. That thing. So literally, was there a wall I could have. Not bounce up there. Uh, there goes the green. Let's have a look across here, the fucking clown. Oh, I 
don't like this. I should have like, just got the camera change button as far away from me as possible. Put it on another keyboard. Why is that literally? Oh, actually, I think that yellow scully thing, I know it's taken me a while to realise that, I might actually be a permanent feature on this map, I think. Could be wrong, though. Oh, it's going well so far. Stole your blue and then crash into a skull, which is probably where the title of the map gets its name. Was it Crystal Skull Cove or something? I don't know where the crystal would have come from. Okay, that was what. Determined on this one. Okay, that was just cheating. Well, they're coming worse places than second. Just did well then. Came in third. Doesn't know its own map, but yeah. Getting a good start on sometimes. Oh, I could have got both then, I think. Oh well. So much clipping. Might as well as be playing this. Might as well be playing this on. Um, I don't know why we live for a bridge. Might as well be playing this on emulator for graphical qualities. Ready? How is Gypsy Knock Moss always catching up? Oh my God! I 
look, I didn't know where I was going. Yay! First place! So an almost perfect tournament, 110 points if I calculate correctly, which considering I don't do maths would be a miracle if I did, which I do. I know counting is not exactly what you do in schools for maths or university anymore, but still. First place! So we've unlocked Gypsy Moth's vehicle thingy and also her face and soup things, you know, I think it took me a while to figure out she was a woman. Which is weird, but still. In fact, until I saw her again, I'd forgotten she was. I still don't know what exactly she is. Is she an alien? Is she an android? Is she a human dressed as an alien android? I don't know. While you contemplate that, I'll see you next week. While we fight Rocket Racer. The guy who's stood there looking all smug and with tribal black hair shit. I have a devil Scooby till next time. Piss off. Devil Boy Scooby. Hello, I'm Devil Boy Scooby, you're not, and welcome back to Let's Play Rocket Racer. No, that's not what it's called. Welcome back to Let's Play Ro No, not Let Robo 6. What the fuck is this called? Welcome back to Let's Play Lego Racers. That's the one we're fighting, Rocket Racer. Oh, no, we're having a bit of a dance because, you know, we're smug. Congratulations, you've proven yourself to be a true Lego champion. But it's not only yet. Is someone meaning to meet you? It's not even moving a mouth. Mouth? Yeah, I know you said mouse. I meant mouth. We probably have facial expressions, but we can't see that. Why is everything so dimly lit in this world? We really need to start affording electricity. We can afford a massive warp gate behind him, but we can't afford any lights. At last, a worthy opponent, but if you want to be the best, you have to race me on my own track. Are you ready? I'll be waiting for you. Yes, of course I'm ready, because I selected the race at the finish line. Yes! Only just, but... Well, it was done in the most anticlimactic style ever. Because I was silent for the last hour. And I'm exhausted and I need to go to sleep. But we won! Oh, I get some balloons. Seriously, we need to sort out some lighting problems in this. Oh, look. Congratulations, I knew I had it in you, mate. Rocket Racer, before he goes on his depressive acid trip, 
but worthy of this prize, a car which you beat, which means it's not as fast as you. So, it's a bit of a moot thing. I'm the greatest Lego racing champion of all time, except for all the people who have done much better than me at this game. Any stupid names in here? Kalbooz. Special thanks to all the children who gave their valuable input through the development of this title. Basically, thanks to all the people who went, Why am I not them? It's giving me attention. I'm bored. Okay, the soundtrack's gone slightly downhill, and that cut off very abruptly. Well, yeah. That was not at all a waste of five hours. Rikes! Well, that was LEGO Racers. I hope you'll join me again soon for Crash Team Racing, which is another racing game only with furry orange pricks instead of LEGO bricks. Hey, that rhymed. Anyway, I've been Scooby Doo. Till next time, worse off. <clears throat>